So hey guys, how are you? I welcome you on to the day three of our SQL series. So today we are going to understand the DDL command where we will create the table. So first of all, it is very important that we create a database. Once we have created the database, then we have to use that database. Using that database means we will select that database. Then only after we can move with creation of your table. So then here we will create our table. So on the left side, if you see in the schema, you will find that this is database is selected. As such, no table is there on the left side. If you see it, now we will create a table. So the command for creating a table is very simple. It's like uh, you will use create then table and what is the name of the table? So suppose if I'm creating an employee table inside this employee table, I wanted to specify the column names also. So here in the parenthesis, I will be specifying the column names. Like suppose if your column one is your employee ID and in the column two, it's your employee name. So whenever you are specifying the column names after the column names, you have to specify the data type of that column like the employee ID is there. I wanted to store this as an integer. That means data type should be an integer An employee name. This is a where care where I'll say it will be a character data. We're having the 20 max to max 20 liters into it. And between that, I will be writing a comma. That means I will be uh, specifying that this is a create command. Now I will be selecting this and I will be executing it. Now here, as you refresh your schema, you'll see the table has been created. So if you see here, the table has been properly created. Now, if I wanted to see what is my table, so I will select everything from employee and then execute it. You will see that the table structure has been created. Now in the next, I will add some records into the table. Then after that, we will move ahead with other commands. So this is the day three. Okay, guys, so subscribe the channel if you find it important. And if you are implementing these commands, so kindly comment also and share your outputs. Thank you, guys. Take care. Bye-bye.